Today I'm going to demonstrate how to measure main bearing bore in the engine block. To make this measurement you need to have the cap installed and you need to have the bearings out of the engine because we're going to measure the machine part here. If we had the bearings in there we wouldn't get the right readings. We've got the cap installed. I've torqued this to the factory spec just to save a little time. And There's two ways you can measure this. You can measure this using an inside micrometer, which would go inside the bore here. Right? Or you could also measure this using a telescoping gauge. And all a telescoping gauge is, a little T-handle like that, screw on the end, spring-loaded plungers. Once you get your reading, you would then measure the telescoping gauge with a micrometer. So we're going to take two measurements here. One measurement is going to be a horizontal measurement. The other measurement is going to be a vertical measurement. The reason we do this, we want to see if that bore has stretched any. If that bore is stretched, we're going to have to send this block out, get it machined, and get that back true circular again. So I'll stick my gauge in there, and I want to rock it back and forth just a little bit to make sure that I've got the right width. I want it to rock it back and forth and make sure it touches the sides so that it'll move freely but my measurement wasn't taken with the gauge turned that way or that way in the bore because it would be longer and my measurements would be inaccurate. And now I'm able to take my micrometer, measure, turn this in just a little bit till, it, till you feel it touch. Now the ratchet stop on my micrometer here, it doesn't slip before it starts pushing the plungers back in, so you may want to be careful of that. So I'm going to lock it down right there. And the reading that I've got here on this micrometer, if you can see it, I've got 65 showing, and I've got four more whole millimeters there showing, so that's at 69. I've got the half millimeter mark showing on the bottom so that's 69 and a half plus an additional 29 so that's going to give me a reading of 69.79 uh, and my spec is 69.78 to 69.83 so we're within spec here if we were not within spec we'd send this block out and they would machine a little bit of material off of that cap to make it sit lower and then they would run an align bore through here and align all the main bearing bores they would all be round and they would all be true again